because there are going to be a lot of things in our lives that aren't going to be the same. And so we've got to be aware of that. And, you know, there's going to be people that have been in comfortable jobs for 15, 20 years that, you know, they might have drastic changes and new norms. And so what are we doing um, if we're in those positions, but also if we're, um, if we are, have our own companies, what are we doing to look at growth rather than sitting back and holding back? Um, I'm sure I, I know some of you follow and I know Liz will have, but um, Richie Norton was on a live, um, I think it was yesterday, maybe today that he was talking about something that I think makes a lot of sense is when thing you know, you look at China, they're starting to have a lot of their things come back to normal. You know, they're, they're getting through this peak. And when that happens with us, there's going to be a flood of everyone trying to hit the markets again and get back to normal. And, you know, while he was talking about it, I, I was, I was envisioning, you know, we see these lineups at Costco and lineups, all these places. And that's what these, businesses and everything are going to be like is we're all going to be cramming to try to get back to normal but there's going to be the empty shelves and so how do we make it so we're at the front of that line how do we make our companies at the front of the line when when everything turns rather than being behind our competition or shoulder to shoulder with our competition so it's i mean like i i completely understand i'm i'm very sympathetic to it uh, I get it, but at the same time, like this, the fear of the in-person thing shouldn't stop from getting, like you said, getting ahead at, during this time, because right now everybody is online, because there's not much to do. You can't really go to the store, you can't do a lot, so you might as well use this time to get yourself ahead of your competitors. Because as I was saying here, and I thought of a really good sports analogy of what's going on and the way you can kind of think about it is if you take the game of basketball, and Jeff, you'll appreciate this, um, everybody has fundamentals that there's fundamentals of basketball and there's fundamentals of business. And what you do with those fundamentals is unique to each team. And like teams will come up with their own plays and different strategies to beat the other team but the fundamentals are all the same and so i feel like right now it's like as if i've come like we for dan and i anyways for me personally it's like i feel like we've come down down the court we moved to utah we found this excellent job we're ready to like you know execute this plan to get us ahead to win the game and we get down and the one player that was supposed to be open isn't open and they're double guarded and all of a sudden it's just like okay what do we do and i think that right now it's just really important to go back to the fundamentals and that don't just pass the ball to that person don't keep with that same game plan because it's going to get turned over it's not going to work but if you just like go back to those fundamentals and you know switch your thinking switch your mindset and look for the next open player and go from there i feel like that's just kind of like the mindset that we need to have right now is like the fundamentals are still there you still have to, you can still know, like, it, like your knowledge isn't wasteful. It's, it, you just have to use it differently. That's all. So 